Hi everyone, this is Miss Grapmas and I'm here with a card for MB Treasury Stamp and I'm using my new stamp Alice Bean from The Greeting Farm. Alice Bean was released a couple of months ago but this is actually the first time I've had a chance to play with her. So the colors uh, and the paper mainly, the paper is from Prima Lyric Collection, you've seen it quite a lot on some of my projects now, uh, amongst other the box tutorial I made. But uh, the color is awesome, really girly, uh, in a non... Uh, uh, very subtle girly, and subtle uh, pink and peach colors. So what I've done is I've taken advantage of the paper as much as possible, meaning I've barely done nothing with this paper. All the banners and everything are from the paper itself. So I've only accented uh, the, the banner with some glossy accent and I've also put uh, the lovebirds uh, um, on uh, some of the banners. Uh, and as you see, the light pink goes so well with the uh, pink uh, in the in the paper itself. And also here, I wanted to uh, show the paper as much as possible, so I haven't covered up these at all. This is entirely in the paper, and this is uh, as well the rulers here. Uh, I've also layered Alice Bean on the paper. So this is a cutout element from the paper. I haven't covered any flowers or anything from the paper. Uh, I've layered it on a, on a darker paper from the collection. So all the papers you see are from the uh, Lyric uh, paper pad. So what I've done is uh, I've added a part of an Azar spray in the light pink as well as some uh, candy gem acrylic sprays in pink as well. I've also used uh, the Sweetheart Blossom and a 10 millimeters uh, rose from Wild Orchid Craft and this is um, very very lightly uh, sprayed with the Linda Stamp Gang Starburst Spray in Saltwater Taffy which you can find in the Natucket Pearl set. Uh, and then the the hip rose buds are also sprayed with uh, the same spray, but uh, a couple of more times to 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 create uh, a darker shade. And here you can see another uh, little rose. Uh, the buttons are from my stash, but the twine is from Ambi Treasuries as well, and um, uh, it's in uh, um, blossom, I believe it's called. I've added some drip Venice lace on just on small and uh, I've, uh, uh, I've hi uh, hidden the, the edge with some brown m mesh bling uh, and it goes behind as well and then to, to hide that edge and also the paper meets behind here. I've uh, just added uh, a string of flatback pearls in light pink as well. Uh, I also have an acrylic butterfly in just clear acrylic but uh, with the, all the other thing is so subtle the clear acrylic goes so well in there. You can also find, I'm not sure if you can see it, but there is a white uh, flat back pearl 10 millimeters behind there as well and I've also added one in light pink on her bow so that is my card I hope you enjoy it if you have any questions uh, please let me know otherwise you can find everything you need for this card at uh, Misty's store mbtreasuries.com and um, for more uh, inspiration from the other members of the design team, please visit MB Treasury Stamps blog, which is uh, mbtreasuries.blogspot.com. I'll have all the links uh, down below for you. So I'll see you there. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.